Welcome, folks. We're going to submit our Games Club to the UK Games Expo community map. It all starts in your UK Games Expo account. This is the account you'll have used to buy tickets if you've attended the show, or manage your exhibitor details if you've traded at a previous UK Games Expo. Don't worry if you don't have an account, they're very easy to set up. All you need is a working email. Now, if you've logged in and you see the blue banner here, all you need to do is switch to your personal account rather than your exhibitor account. This is done at a button on the bottom left, and it says switch to personal account. When we're in the right place and we can see this orange banner at the top, we're going to scroll down to the section at the bottom called Games Community. Clicking on this brings us to a new section with these four icons on the right. We want to add our club to the listings, so let's click on Club. This short form is going to take all the information needed to include your club on the community map. You've likely already written this information out for something like a website or social media page, so it shouldn't take too long. The form doesn't save as we go, and we'll need to complete it in one section, so we should just set aside around 10 minutes to get everything done. All the information here is quite simple, but some of it can be more detailed than others. This name is for the club name, not your own, and the short description is roughly a one sentence description of your club. This next section is where we can put all the information about our club for folks to find. We should include things like the type of games we play and if we have subs or a membership. Is it free on our first visit? Do people have to bring their own games? Or do you have ones that people can borrow? Do you have to arrange long games in advance? How about if there's a regular tournament or league for some of the games we play? We should include things like if our club is in a room inside a larger building and how they find their way there. Is there a cafe or a bar or a tuck shop and so on? What we don't need to add in here is things like special events, your annual Secret Santa or your special games day. What we just need here is information that will last about a year and you shouldn't need to update unless you do something like move a venue. You can take some time to format this, make things bold or add in bullet points, put italics on things to make stuff easier to read. I have enough information here, so I'm gonna move on to adding a logo. You don't have to have a logo for your club, but you have something on a social media or a website that would work fine. There's a file size limit, so don't put anything too big in. Frequency is just how often we meet. Weekly, monthly, twice a week. If we don't meet that regular, we might want to consider using a convention listing instead, as this would let us add specific dates. But this club meets weekly at 7 p.m., so we've added that. Moving on, we're going to add our location. We're going to list the building that our club meets at, and the map will update as we go. Make sure to include a postcode and take a moment to check that the map has us in the right place. If it's not, we can move the pin closer to where we really are, but this one looks fine for our club. Moving on to contact details, I'm only going to add information here that I'm happy to be publicly listed. I have an email, but my club doesn't have a phone number, so we're just going to leave that out. You might list one that you're happy being available, or perhaps the building that you hold your club at. The final part of the form is adding in some websites or social media links. We don't have a website, so I've just listed the Facebook group, but if we had more things to list, I could click on the little plus sign and add another and repeat until everything I have is included. I think I'm done, but like an exam at school, I'm just gonna take a moment to check over everything. And then when I'm happy, I'll click submit. This brings us back to the games community page but now we can see the green banner confirming we've submitted a club. And it lists our club in the section below with pending as the status. We just need to wait for a member of the UK Games Expo team to check it over and approve our listing. We'll get an email to let us know and the status on the page will change too. That email will come to the one on our account, the one we used when we logged in. It's written up on the banner at the top to remind us if you're not sure what you put. That's it. We've listed our club and now we can go back to playing games.